Welcome back to the Kathy Raley Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Sam Murray. Joined now with Stevenson Women's Lacrosse Head Coach Kathy Raley. And Coach, big win on Saturday. Kind of come from behind there. You, you yeah. know, you're down late and then you score two goals to get the win. Talk us, Take us through that game. Sure. I th- you know, I think more than anything, it was a moral victory for us. Um, oftentimes, we're the better team for two-thirds of a game. And then for one-third of a game, somewhere in the second half, we somehow just do not function on all cylinders. <laughs> we don't make smart plays. We turn the ball over a lot. We don't uh, read what other teams are throwing at us. And I think that comes from being such a young team. When you have you know, 18 freshmen and sophomores out there, um, I think that that tends to be what happens. So I really thought that Saturday was a moral victory because we were able to gut out the win after an ugly 15 minutes. I thought. Um, So that always makes a coach feel good to know that you can kind of have an ugly section of the game and and get back the good enough play to win the game. So I think that that was big for us. So what do you take away from that game moving into this week? You have hopefully Washington College on Wednesday, and then you have your spring break trip out west. Sure. Well, I think we have to take uh, into consideration a lot of different things. Number one, I think we started to utilize the clock a little bit better in the Randolph-Macon game in the first half in particular. Um, In the second half, I thought we got a little complacent. We had a couple of shot clock violation turnovers, which that's not the worst thing in the world. Um, We're definitely utilizing some of the clock, but I definitely want to get a shot off in that 90 seconds. So um, I think we've spent some time this week working on that. Washington College plays such a unique style of attack that I'm really looking forward to see how our defense handles it, uh, executes what we're going to try, what our game plan is going to be. So I'm very much looking forward to see how high our learning curve has been, will be in this in this Monday Tuesday practice and Wednesday execution. So that's going to tell us a lot about how we handle the remainder of the year. Um, as far as spring break goes, we cannot wait to see the sunshine. Uh, it is absolutely terrible out there today. It's going to be terrible out there tomorrow. Um, if we could get on the plane tomorrow following the game, that's what I would do if I could. We scheduled two regionally ranked teams at the conclusion of 2017, Claremont Mud Scripps and Chapman University. Um, you know, you know, they're both really good teams. Claremont Monscripts has made it into the top 25. Um, actually, they started the season in the top 25. I think they may have made it into the top 20 uh, this past week. Um, I've watched them play a few games so far this season. They're a little bit ab- ahead of us, I think, in just um, because they can get out there and practice so much in the great weather. Uh, Chapman, I think we will handle. I think we're going to be able to really do some really good, amazing uh, attack things. Claremont Mud Scribs is going to be a battle. Hopefully we can come back from California with two wins over regionally ranked teams and have that really help us in case we need a Pool C bid at the conclusion of the season. Well, Coach, we wish you the best of luck, and we'll see you back here after spring break, hopefully with a little bit of a tan going on. Hey, yes, you know. (laughs) You know I'll be a little blonder and a little more tan. (laughs) All right. For Coach Kathy Raley, I'm Sam Murray, and this has been the Kathy Raley Show.